Hello guys and welcome back. Gonna do a, a little bit of a restoration on the uh, Spy Island set. So I got this one in I guess close to a year ago. I just haven't gotten to it. Uh, it's in rough shape so you can see the sweater is split open completely on this arm. Uh, it's got a little bit of staining kind of crusty not sure if it's gonna come out or not but we'll try shoulder over here is also split staining all around looks a bit stretched out too but not really sure probably is uh, this is an official GI Joe uniform so you can see the tag uh, did come with the pants as well a lot of loose threads going on here might have to uh, definitely have to do some sewing and some cleaning I don't have a complete set here so do got a few different hats just need a little cleaning up and this one too and I uh, got a couple of the uh, pieces for the dive equipment but not much do got the red binoculars it's got a melt mark on there, but it is what it is. I could re-thread and make the uh, loop for it. And I do got the flippers. So just a matter of uh, doing some cleanup. And I'll collect the rest of the pieces as I go. But uh, I'm going to work on these pants. So what I got is uh, my 1-6 scale wash machine, which is any jar basically and I just put a little bit of a uh, Dawn detergent in there uh, in the lukewarm water you could use cold uh, but I figured the warm might help to break the stain a bit so just a matter of washing them first before we get into any sewing so we got a good idea on what is going to be needed I fill that up a little higher than I should have, but you get the idea. So really it's just a matter of shaking it around, letting it sit for a while, coming around and shaking it again. And you can see the amount of crud that was in these. These were really filthy. When I got them, and it's just been in a box ever since. So, again, let the uh, the water, the soap, and the agitation do its job. Okay, so the clothes are now washed and dried. Pants came out good. The top. We had a little problem in the back. Uh, those crusty parts just uh, were kind of masking a hole. But uh, as long as I use that on the back, I think this will still be salvageable. So in order to sew it, you got to turn it inside out and sew the seams that were messed up. So I'll do that. Okay, now with the shirt inside out you can see what you gotta kinda work with so you got this is the tear so just a matter of restitching this area here so I've got my needle threaded and go ahead and get started with this
All right, so I think I have stitched up all of the holes, this sleeve, this sleeve, and underneath this one. So let's see what we got. Okay, so this is the G.I. Joe that came with a lot of uh, gear of the uh, Spy Island. So let's get him dressed up and see how he looks. Okay, so here he is all uh, finished up. So the uh, uniform, while not perfect, uh, I think is displayable, usable uh, in its current state now. It's clean. It's not uh, filthy. Um, Pretty much all of the holes have been sewn back uh, together. Uh, binoculars got their string. And uh, Joe is back in uniform. So again, this is not a complete set. But uh, it's a good start to a vintage spy island. So I'm glad to have it in the collection. Uh, Joe is in uh, pretty good shape overall too. Got great flocking. So he's uh, ready to go into action. Thanks for watching, guys. Till next time.